the uh, Metro GM, brand new Metro GM, is apologizing to another woman in another incident. Uh, apparently, young people throwing stuff on her uh, as she was going out to a show at the Kennedy Center. Uh, and uh, we uh, had a chance to talk to her today. And here's a little bit about uh, Haley, uh, Haley's story. Paul says she was on the lower level at Lawn Farm when the young people first dropped a can next to her. Then came a McDonald's McFlurry and then what looks like a bunch of crackers. I'm covered in crap, she wrote. Haley, so sorry this happened to you, Metra's new GM responded. We are working to address these types of issues, enhancing transit police and staff deployment and visibility. Todd Kimmelman tweeted back, no one within WMATA seems to care about it. Not the people in the booths, not the Metro cops, and certainly not the people jumping the fare gates. You have a tall task ahead of you, he told the GM. Conduct like this has become normal, tweeted Capital Jeff. But there was also this from Amanda Beal. You can Google horror stories for every mode of transportation. Please stop. Metro is reliable and uncouth teens exist everywhere. And also this, oh God, however will you recover? Those spots must be rather traumatic to endure. To which Kroll responded, I was hit on the head first, but sure, be a jerk on the internet. All right, back down live. Uh, this is uh, crime scene uh, investigators for Metro Transit Police uh, currently going down into the L'Enfant Plaza uh, Center uh, station to be uh, to investigate this shooting. Uh, one person apparently shot, apparently minor injuries, and it looks like it happened down inside the station, but we haven't been able to confirm that at this point. You can see the people coming in and out, so the station is still open, uh, but apparently you cannot go uh, from Lawn Font towards Branch Avenue on the Green Line at this point. Now, in terms of the, the um, situation uh, with those kind of assaults, uh, Metro apparently doesn't keep track of those kind of simple assaults. Aggravated assaults have been up, and the data shows it, uh, up significantly last year and also up uh, this year 113 aggravated assaults in the metro system uh the metro gm now promising uh to do something to keep this situation more safe here lorenzo back to you yeah he's gonna have to do something quickly about this bruce and just a quick service update metro rail just tweeting this out a short time ago saying they have a green line alert for that service from lafont plaza to branch avenue they're saying board the green line train to greenbelt get off at national archives the station prior and then board the green line to Branch Avenue, so you got to do a little finagling there just to try and get home if you're going in the direction of Branch Avenue. We know this is still a developing situation there at LaFont Plaza Metro Station. Bruce, we'll let you gather a little more information and we will touch base with you shortly. All right, Bruce Lashander, thank you so much.